Okay, hello YouTube community. Um, this is how to hack a soda stream. Okay, so I recently bought this about uh, two or three months ago during Black Friday. No, like four months ago now, Black Friday. It's like 30 bucks. Um, it came with this thing, like the the pre whatever tiny little bottle. Um, this thing lasted me roughly like three or four days um, and then I looked on YouTube to find like how to you know find cheap ways of you know f refilling this and there was a lot of videos of people like opening this part up and then like like you know the, the bigger one and opening this part up and then putting dry ice in there and then closing it and then and then waiting for it to melt and then and that became liquid CO2 etc etc cetera, et cetera, et cetera. and I was like alright that seems pretty simple but I started looking around for dry ice vendors, and it was ridiculous, it was crazy, so I was like, alright, forget that, I'm not going to do that, that's going to take too long. I googled it, and I came up uh, on a website that described a way to um, get like a, uh, whatchamacallit, an adapter, I guess, for the back, and then to attach it to a, a larger CO2 tank. I originally bought a five pound CO2 tank, and then that lasted me about a week, and so this past... Uh, week I went out and I got this baby right here oh yeah Ow. this baby right there Ooh, birdie. that's a beautiful 20 pound co2 tank I just filled it up um, I got this off eBay it was like a hundred twenty bucks I think roughly around there uh, back. it's supposed to be all right um, so I got the soda stream for like 40 bucks. Um and the adapter that it, that I bought off of eBay was like 25 bucks, 30 bucks, something like that. It's this. It's uh it's pretty much like a wire that essentially Connects into the CO2 tank. Okay, so uh, give me a second while I. Uh, let me uh, show you guys. So uh, at the local welding place or the local fire department that store uh, refill CO2. Uh, fire extinguishers. I paid about I paid 26 bucks to refill this uh, to fill the CO2 tank with CO2. All right, so you just uh, so look, okay, pretty much it goes up. I put it underneath. You can put it out, whatever it may be, and it goes beautifully into there. Now, when you uh, when you Tighten this, don't tighten too much because it might strip the plastic and you don't want to do that. You want a tight seal, so that's fine. Um, okay, so let me close that up. Oops. It's hard to record. Okay, let me close that up. Let me set this up. Beautiful, beautiful. Okay, and then you got to be careful when you turn this on because it's, you know, it's CO2 and you don't want to like pull your hand off or whatever so you turn it on turn it on all the way so now this will be pumping co2 from the 20 pound into your soda stream all right so yeah fill fill this with water fill this with water Back to the line I think I remember this is a, this is a uh, one, one liter bottle. All right, let me put it in. And uh, I looked on YouTube to find like a video to explain how this works, but I couldn't find one. So I was like, all right, whenever I, I finish, I'll just do it myself and I'll make one. All right, and so ready? One, two, three. One, two, three. It says three, but I do like to go like, you know, 10, 10 pumps or whatever. Alright, 
I like it like really carbonated, so I just go crazy. Pretty much like you have like unlimited supply of carbon dioxide, so Ooh, I love seltzer. Alright. You the man, Paul. Thank you, thank you. Alright. So now we enjoy. Bottoms up. 